I chose my MA in contemporary culture and literature, I think, for a few reasons. I think, first off, the course here at Birkbeck was incredibly progressive and open-minded. And what was really interesting about it, it wasn't just books and novels. They, they talked about how we would look at culture when it comes to video games, to music, to film. We look at um, a range of 21st century texts. So we look at everything from sort of Margaret Atwood to digital literatures. We look at the Anthropocene, we look at ideas of nation after 9-11. So it's a very diverse selection of texts that covers British, American, European and post-colonial narratives. I think the most inspiring module on the course is probably the core one about reading the contemporary, which is full of brand new books and texts and films, which are often, if only, come out in the, in the last year. I would say that it's a great foundation for critical thinking and looking into theory and getting your mind working. It evokes so many ideas, so many concepts, and it speaks to the world we're living in. Personally, I, I've spent some time doing um, 21st century feminism, which has been incredibly exciting. And also, more recently, I'm doing the post-colonial novel. So for the summer programme, we um, host an event called Arts Week, the Contemporary. One of the biggest things that I'm doing this year is contributing towards the Arts Week, and I never would have thought that it was something that I could do. Creating an arts-based installation, it's not who I am. I don't claim to be an artist, but this course has pushed me into taking the risk of being inspired by something I've read and making it my own own almost. If you're wavering, wondering, should I, is the MA for me, or should I do it, or should I not do it, I would just say, go ahead and go for it. It's nice to, to feel that you, you belong somewhere as well. I would say, um, take the risk, because it's worth it.